For Metro Exodus Enhanced Edition, the most important thing, in my opinion, is the shadow detail, because you're going to be on the darkness most of the game. So the HDR10 implementation has the black level race. So that's just a deal breaker. It doesn't matter if it's going to give you amazing highlights. And it doesn't, by the way. If you have the, the black level race. So in my opinion, what we can definitely get right now on HDR is perfect shadow detail because the developers you know, for some movies and for some games on their vision they have those 10,000 nits or 4,000 nits that, that these TVs cannot do so you are not going to be able to get even a thousand nits if you have a C1 or CX or C2 you cannot get even 1,000 nits, let alone what the creators of most of the games are, you know, on their vision, you know, those 4,000, 10,000 nits. So the most important attribute of HDR that we can definitely get right now is the shadow detail. So in my opinion, if you have an HDR implementation that has the black level rays, meaning on the darkness, everything looks like gray it looks like an LCD screen that's how it looks because you don't have perfect black it's just everything is raised and on this game you don't even have settings to adjust and, and fix that so it's broken that's that's how I would say that it's just broken it's not worth even trying it's terrible so on the other hand HLG over the SDR on this game is doing a fantastic job. I'm gonna show you that uh, next on the on part two, and you will see it's not even close. This game, unless it's just Windows, you let me know how this game looks on on a PS5 and on Xbox Series X with the HDR, uh, because maybe the, that HDR calibration from the console is doing a much better job than Windows you let me know but on PC it is unusable in my opinion HDR 10 from the game is just bad it's terrible and the highlights are not even uh, you know, are not even better so yeah it's just HLG HDR is a lot a lot a lot a lot better it's just transformative. So yeah, that's my point. In my opinion, the most important thing that we have to look at right now on HDR is getting at least the shadow detail perfect. Because that, that's what we can get. In the future, we're going to get this 10,000 nits you know, capable displays, okay? And in that moment, then we can think about getting, you know, you, we need to get the, that creator's intent, that vision uh, of 10,000 nits, you know, big brightness or, or highlights. But for right now, you, def you can definitely at least get the shadow detail. <laughs> and for me, all those games that have HDR with a black level race and you cannot fix it, that's not a good option. Sorry, <laughs> I, I, I don't care if the highlights are 800 nits. If the black level is raised, it's just, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. Especially this game. So most of the game you are gonna be on the darkness. So yeah.